embrace of ambiguity, which invites multiple meanings and diverse usage. The ambiguous scene between the civic and the domestic spheres of my grandmother's house, street, and neighborhood. Inundation of the spine structure with flooding. Before I can go MIT to study architecture, I studied and worked in the nuclear field for eight years. Radioactivity has no boundaries. The ocean current will bring radiation all around the world. And also to make visible the, the extended processes of building and unfuilding within the global setting. Kayoyi also serves as a food source for migratory birds in the desert, such as great white pelican and blue heron. How it could begin to adapt towards a system that is using wood that is directly taken from the forest. The thickness of a wedding park is unseen to the majority of the population. This is the new pill that could perhaps create a different domestic reality. Moving from high resolution to low, we begin at the unit. Painting shadows, unrolling grass, inflating trees. An abandoned structure and transform it into a life source for its surrounding community. They were built without thinking that the railway line was ever going to be reused. The federal government in Germany actually elected to rebuild the palace. I mean, I love this idea of the space as a civic space. I can't really imagine it through her eyes, so it's, it's sort of a fiction within a fiction. And I think that was something that we were interested in. How much do we reveal our hands? How much do we reveal? We don't have a way of knowing for certain, and, and neither do you. Who is me full? What I'm offering today is not a design proposal, but rather a proposal for how to design through the interaction of part, site, action, and protocol. Today, the digital media adds another dimension on top of the simple binary of the ruined space. The material logic of the digital era increasingly undermines the notion of an inherent physical truth in architectural materials. And confront topics that are difficult to reach within our normal modes of discourse. To formulate our perspective on what showing labor actually entails, we first needed to learn to see it for ourselves. Labor management does not solely have to happen the business way, but can happen the architect's way too.